so lately I've been watching a lot of videos called My Pet Videos. And what it is, is people just showing their pets. And all the ones I've been watching have like their cats or their dogs. So I really want to do one with my pet, Iguana. And this is Fred. So Fred is me and my boyfriend's pet, Iguana, actually. And um, we've had him for probably six months now. And he was given to us by an older man that could not take care of him anymore. Because when they get this big, it's kind of hard to take care of them. So you need to be able to do that. And he really couldn't, so I'm really glad that we got Fred, though. He is um, five. And so I'm just going to go through some questions that I get asked a lot. So what I get asked a lot is, what does Fred eat? So Fred is a vegetarian. And he eats romaine lettuce every day and with fruit. So he loves strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, all those kind of good fruits. Um, he does eat people food once in a while, but that's a treat to him. So when he eats poop people food, he usually eats grilled cheese, pasta, um, what else does he eat? He eats subs. Basically anything we eat, he'll eat. He, um... If he sees like us eating something, he'll come up to us and he'll want it, so he's basically like a dog. Um, most people are really scared of Fred when they first see him, but he's actually like the nicest iguana I've ever met. And he's very friendly. And as you can see, he's like falling asleep on me right now. He's really tired. Um, me and my boyfriend treat him like our little kid, basically. Um, in the summer, we have a wagon. And we pull Fred in the wagon in the summer and take him for a walk. He In the summer, he's outside every single day, basically all day, and he'll like suntan. Because that's his favorite thing to do. But because it's winter and there's snow here, he can't go outside. So bas he's, basically, he's not the same as he would be in the summer. In the summer, he's a lot more oranger, and he moves a lot more. But in the winter, he's more lazy, and he just sleeps all day long, basically. Um... So yeah, I was really excited to do this video. Um, yeah, so if you guys ever have like any other questions on him, just let me know and I'll do another video with him. So make sure you, sh you guys subscribe to my videos if you want to see more of him. And in the summer, I'll be doing a lot more videos with him because we'll be outside and stuff more. And um, another thing is that people ask, um, where can you buy iguanas? Um, don't bother asking me that because they're really uh, rare to find, like they're not easy to find. Most places that you ask for them, they say they don't sell them anymore. Because when they get big like this, they're actually really hard to take care of. And, oh, you just sneeze. And, um, so that's why they don't sell them anymore. They usually, when they get big like this, people like abandon them and just drop them off wherever outside and don't take care of them because... When they're like this, you, they eat a lot, and they want to be out every single day. Um, you have to give them a bath, you have to... So it's basically like having a dog. Some people are good at taking care of the dogs, but some people are not good and not meant to have animals. Um, yeah, so I think most places, like, strictly do not sell iguanas. Um, there is other kinds of lizards, but they don't grow as big, so I have um, a bearded dragon too. And it's a lot, it doesn't grow as big as this. It'll probably be like this size, I think. Um, when he's full grown right now, he's a baby. Um, so yeah, you probably won't find one like this. So that's why it's really cool that I did this video to show you guys. So thank you for watching. And I hope you guys like meeting Fred. And have an amazing day. And make sure you guys subscribe. Thank you.